Hello everyone, today we will model this part together. Uh, let's open a new part in SOLIDWORKS. And on top plane, we create a sketch. And at first, we create a circle. Then later on, we create two lines and one more line. All these guys should be construction geometry. This two point should be symmetric. Simply what we do, choosing points and the center line, pressing control and making them symmetric. And then we make them vertical. Now giving a value of 72. Uh, here we have a 60 and everything seems fine. And maybe we can split entities rather than making a tree. So sometimes good to learn new things. Yes. Then you will not lose any reference and program will not give any error. Which mostly happens when you make trim. Then extrude surface. Next step. Somewhere 25 I think will be sufficient for us. We look from plane and normal to and create here one sketch. At first I would like to have here a center where I will place it at 7 mm. Then a spline a 3 point start, middle and ending. And then later a little bit play with spline control points these two will be parallel if you don't want to make in that way simply you draw a line and I do always say this in my tutorials and you make uh, sorry you make your tendency which is nice and what we can do creating a relationship horizontal relationship between these two points we make them horizontal and here we have a line. Now we do have here a diameter of 8. We do have here a diameter of 4. Part a bit moving. Maybe it's good to constrain some things. This will be coincident. We should give some tangency values. Maybe 15 and 15 here here also we have a control point which is still not fully defined as you see parallel sorry this was parallel to here ah. if it's not working we can just give an angle zero and here we have a tangency value of 20. Uh, do we miss something we are going to check first. Tendency values are done. Hmm. Yes, we don't have this diameter for everything. Black, that means full defined, you see here. Then we are going to make a mirror entities. They will have a mirror. And we have one more line here. Now is a construction line. And this will be at six and one more mirror mirror of this one mirror of mirror good now we have the thing that we need curves split line projection selected and surface and uh, our sketch selected and simply we create this one we should show first sketch where we create our surface extrude top plane selected this line selected, we create the red plane. Right plane active, top plane selected, line selected, and here we create another plane. Plane one have one diameter, uh, one circle, diameter four. 
claim to have again the same. We open there simply as sketch and in the middle of this surface break I place the circle. And then in fact these should be semicircles. Let's get rid of unnecessary part. Yes guys. Now I do have one more plane, white plane, and here an 8 millimeter we will have, and we will simply need some extra tools to place it easily. This is selected. This will be pierce, and I'm going to continue with that till here, and then three entities. Yes, uh, we do have three object loft selected first and second and third boundary guide curves. These are guide curves. Everything looking fine. Only sketch one and sketch four will be normal to plane. First operation is done and second operation Again, on plane 1, creating a sketch. We can go also arc while I'm spending my time with this an arc here. Fully defined. Sometimes I'm continuing my old habits. And arc again here. Center arc. And on the right plane, now I'm going to create the last object. Then we are finishing with this operation. Three entities, this is also trimmed. Yes, loft, profile first, profile second, and third, and guide curves. And what we do now, we create normal to profile. Yes, we have three surface bodies. At the end, we have this one. Yes. Now we are going to create a pattern. White plane we can hide. Well, uh, origin and top plane is selected. Axis. We have a pattern of five circular pattern. These are bodies. We are going to make five instances. Let's knit them and give a fillet. Here a fillet of one. Yes. And then we are going to select face fillet. Didn't work. Face one, face two, radius one, and we change the pulling direction it should work now yes we create it and now top plate selected features linear pattern and bodies this one it should be on 15 or 12 i think yes 12 and five instances you could think why i did this first instead of finishing everything. Sometimes we have this problem with filleting in some places. I do prefer to fix in advance mid surface. We need everything. Now I'm going to repeat this operation. We should change pulling direction in inwards and we are going to have the radius then that we want. Here also I do have, have two object, one in this, one in this. You can play with the radius value. You can create different. Yes, that's good. 
we send that and now we look from front again and I'm going to create here a line which will be at 7 I believe our center value was 7 yes and another one here Four or fifty five. Yes, fifty four point five. Good. And then now what we are doing? Simply going trim. Standard trim trim active. Now we are going to use sketch, that's why standard trim. And we are going to remove sections that we don't want to have. Selections, sorry. And simply the areas gone. Open loop selected. Planar surface selected. Need will be done. And one more radius here. Let's give this time a big radius. Like radius 2. Everything fine and now thicken. I'm going to make two millimeter thicken. Waiting a bit. Two millimeter inwards. Or this is outward. Yeah, maybe we should change. Sorry. It's waiting. Yes, I did change the direction of uh, ticking operation inwards instead of outwards and then everything was fine. Just adding here two time one millimeter radius will make our model look nice better. Yes. This was all. I think it was a nice example and looking nice. Also use, uh, use several surfacing, different surfacing commands. Uh, please, if you like my video, make a comment and hit the like button. Thanks for watching and see you in another video.